Welcome to Awesome Code. Please subscribe to my channel. In this video, we will write a C program on Linux that reads some user and system information. This program will fetch our user ID, current working directory, the machine's total and free random access memory, and current process ID. So I will include the header files. I have standard IO. Uh, we don't need this. Include uni standard dot edge. Standard symbolic constants and types. And from system types dot edge. include sys sys info dot edge and then we have our main function and we will have a array for our current working directory the current directory Initialize all elements to zero. And now we are going to have a struct data type for our system information. That will be our sysinfo type struct sysinfo. system information and then we are going to call get current working directory function get CWD and pass in our current directory array And the length and get a now we are going to get a system information by calling sysinfo function and pass in our sysinfo structure And this will work for Linux only systems. And now we are going to get the user ID to print. by calling get UID function. Then we are going to print a current working directory. Print f current working directory and 
passing current directory array. And now we are going to print uh, RAM in megabytes. our sys info divided by one zero two four and then we are going to print the free RAM This should be total RAM. And print F machine has megabytes of free RAM. This will be sysinfo free RAM yeah, by 1024 divided by 1024 And now we are going to print the process. How many processes are running? in four dot proc and uh, we can also get the process ID of the current process so this will be a print F this process ID by calling get PID function. We can also get the parent process ID. PID parent ID process parent ID and at the end we are just going to return zero for our main function this one is prox and this one F is missing for the printf. You fix that. And here is the output of our program. 
user ID as an admin, a root, and the current working directory, and RAM. Uh, this should be on next line. So I'll add a new line after this one. Uh, where is um, should be after this? Let's uh, save it and run it again. And the total RAM and free RAM process running this process ID, parent process ID. To keep on learning, please subscribe to our same code. Like my video, keep supporting me, and thank you for watching.